All right, let's get out to our team of reporters out there showing us conditions all across the region. Our Storm Watch team coverage continues now with Richard Reeve live in Winchester. Hi, Rich. Hi, how you doing? I tell you, talking about getting slammed, Winchester got it pretty good here. We're talking about eight inches, and this is that heavy, wet snow that uh, maybe skiers like, but drivers don't. Now, look behind me. This is an access road to one of the uh, shopping plazas here. Steve Rudin talked about this. This is the stuff that's going to freeze tonight, but when we pan over further, we can see Route 7. We actually have some pavement showing, folks, but it has been a struggle here. Take a look earlier. This was I-81. Uh, a little after 2 this afternoon, they had a car fire combined with the conditions out here. It backed up traffic in the northbound lane for quite a long time, a backup for several miles. The other route, as we've been talking about, Route 7, pretty stubborn. They had an army of plows, both VDOT plows and county plows, up and down this road, and it still remains slushy for much of the day. The side roads, of course, always difficult. This was a challenging time for drivers, even for folks for, with SUVs. A lot of folks getting weary of this. The, the roads are horrible. Uh, visibility is probably less than a quarter mile. Uh, that means there's a lot of snow coming down right now, and the plows can't keep up with getting it off the road. First half was kind of not so bad with the snow. You know, it was cold, but it didn't snow a lot. But now we're getting farther with snow all the time. So hopefully, it's the last one. Yeah. Getting tired of this? Oh yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of folks getting tired of this. As Steve Rudin mentioned, though, the good news is that the snowfall is beginning to dissipate. But again, the big challenge, this stuff behind me, the stuff that's slush, is going to be freezing later. Even more challenges for drivers. In Winchester, Richard Reeve, ABC 7 News. Okay, Rich.